Well, good morning. It is Thursday morning, and it is quite mild here in Wisconsin, central Wisconsin. And as I was thinking about yesterday, this week I've eaten poorly at least three days. Why did I do that? Why do I do that to myself? Do you think it has something to do with the fact that I'm on the verge of hitting going below my 200 mark on my weight loss and for some reason like I sabotage myself so that so that I don't that I don't go under 200 like so that I continue to have like this big goal to, to accomplish this big 200 mark when really I have plenty more pounds to lose besides that so I don't get it like I knew that I knew that this coming Monday I'm on the cusp of getting below 200 pounds if I continue to lose and yet I still had three cheat meals this week uh, I guess four if you count supper on one of them so it's just kind of like really really strange what happens in the in the head and in the body and what you know habits that we get into or thought processes we think of now like I said I'll be surprised if I lose on Monday most likely I'll game and all the work that it took me to get below the 200 mark, or near the 200 mark, or right on the nose at the 200 mark, will all probably be another big gain. <laughs> Hopefully it won't, it'll just be a temporary gain. But <clears throat> nonetheless, it goes through my mind. I will add that it's that time of the month for me. So if I want to say that that's an excuse and that's why I'm gaining, then I'll just say that. <laughs> Hey, our mailman is delivering mail this early in the morning. Maybe they forgot to deliver to us yesterday. Oh, I'm so thrilled. My dress came. Look how pretty that is. Isn't that beautiful? All the sequins and sparklies. I love it. Can't wait to wear it this Christmas season. It's so pretty. You know what I think my problem was yesterday with this hairspray is that I wasn't holding it far enough away from my head. I think I was getting too close and it was creating like all that extra residue on my hair because I don't know how to hold a hairspray bottle. <laughs> Obviously I don't use hairspray often. I just wanted to try it and see how it held and it held really well yesterday despite all the white residue it placed on my hair. So today I'm going to try it again. Okay, much better. I held it at least mm, 18 to 20 inches away from my head. <laughs> Hopefully, I got product on my hair. I'm late. I'm late. I'm very, very late. <laughs> I'm not like very late, but I'm certainly not on time. <laughs> Usually, I'm at work in the parking lot waiting by now. Yeah, I don't know what the deal is just one of those days running behind I knew it as soon as I got on my walk and I started talking to you guys I'm like ooh the time <laughs> um I was like oh I'm gonna be cutting it close but I still have faith I'm gonna get to work on time today so I think I got my ipsy box collection or my subscription gosh I keep showing you guys my edges up here ooh! so I've got my ipsy box or ipsy bag um, that came in the mail today and I can't wait to see what it says or what's in there. It's going to be exciting. Tonight is Zumba night with my girlfriend Heidi. Yes, we need to work and shake off all those extra pounds and calories we ate yesterday. Ooh. Now keep in mind, after I rewatched the video yesterday, I made it almost look like, oh hey, we're just outwardly being naughty and eating this McDonald's. Well, I mean, it weighed heavy on both of our minds. We both are trying to want to lose weight, but sometimes you just got to eat a meal out with your friend. And that was one of those days. So I did. And we had a good time together. And we laughed and we giggled and had fun. So I just want you to know it wasn't like I was like rubbing it in anybody's face and saying, oh, I'm eating McDonald's. <laughs> because guess who it's gonna hurt? Me. It's just gonna hurt me in the end. I'm the one that consumed the calories, so I'm the one that's gotta work it off. However, last night, my husband and I did go to the YMCA, and we did our steps, and we went walking. So, I feel better about it. All right, 
Got to finish this week strong out. It's Thursday. I've got one more day of work this week. Tomorrow's the big sack exchange. Can't wait. And uh, yes, I got to get those sacks out in the mail to Rach. All right, we'll talk to you for a minute. And hi. All right, so Heidi and I are on our way. We're at lunchtime now, and we're on our way to the wellness center where we're going to start working out full time. And um, we're just going to check and see real quick if our badges work. And then we have to hit up the um, dollar store. So come along with us. That's good. Let's see how full it is. Okay. Please close the door after. So how do you do this? Click it. Did it go? I didn't hear anything. Go check the door. Mine doesn't. No. Go check the door. Oh, doggone. We don't have access yet. Well, we were both denied. <laughs> so I guess that means, hey, that we can't work out. <laughs> Shucks darn. Maybe next week we could try. They said it would be ready to go by tomorrow. I guess I, I, guess I should give them one more day. I will say that Heidi and I were really good today. We did not go out to eat at lunch. We both brought our lunches from home. Oh, baby, I just got home from Zumba. My back, my hips, my knees, everywhere aches. Look, my hair doesn't even want to stay in a ponytail because it's so short now. Oh, la, la, la. But it's done. You want to know how many steps I have? I'll show you. What's that say? 13,479 steps. I've I've climbed five flights of stairs, burned 2459 calories, heart rate currently 91. It's just because I'm still crazy. And I feel good. So yeah, now it is time to make supper. I've got to change out of this outfit so I'm not still sweaty, wet, and cold. And then I'm going to sit back and relax, play with the dog till he gets tired out. And then maybe I can have some of my time. I'm going to catch up on some YouTube videos, people. It's not that I don't want to watch them. I'm just really focused this time on getting my vlogs done myself. So I got to make sure I got to take the time to watch your guys' videos, too. I appreciate everybody who's um, enjoying all of the vlogmas and other people who are contributing. This is really fun. It's been a lot of fun, hasn't it? Have you guys been enjoying these videos? Let me know. Um, all right. I feel like a wreck. I look like a wreck. Let's get supper done. Okay, here's my supper. I made the Thomas Thinly Sliced Bagel with everything flavoring. I made three eggs, of course, my usual. One with a yolk, two with just the egg whites. I have my ten uh, mini turkey pepperonis. Um, and then look what I found my cupboard yahoo veggie chips the ghost and bats this is from halloween it's still good i'm still eating it um just so i can have a little bit of crunch with my meal and then i've got green beans warming up in the microwave and then kool-aid sugar-free all right so it is the end of the night and i just wanted to show you a few things that came in the mail today so i purchased a six pack of the built bars and I got it from Fun Fit Fabulous Mama. Um, and you could get all of these bars for $3. There was no shipping fees. So that, what, broke down to $0.50 cents a bar? Like, who couldn't try that? And then there's different flavors. I'm sure you guys have seen all of these from a lot of your favorite YouTubers. But um, they have mint chocolate... Raspberry chocolate, caramel orange, coconut, and I don't know what the last flavor is, but very excited to try it. Now, I'm going to show you something else that I got today. 
So it was the sweetest thing. Yesterday, remember how I went and played Santa and I went and put candy canes in everybody's stacking? Then there was a couple friends that I purposefully went and bought a special Christmas gift and a little goodbye gift because I'm leaving the department. And then this morning I got to my desk and these um, two friends of mine gifted me back. They played Santa on me before I got to work. So this was really exciting. My girlfriend Heidi that you always see in my vlogs, she got me this cute little puppy calendar. <laughs> it says yoga puppies. So on the back, they're all doing these different yoga poses uh, through the whole uh, months and the year. So that's exciting. And then she also bought me this, um, I don't know how to pronounce it, Baki? It's hazelnut chocolate, little chocolates. Ooh, ooh, I already opened them. And yes, I had one and it was good and they're very tasty. And then, um, one of my guy pals, Joel, um, I bought him a gift, and then this morning on my desk, he knows I am a freak for Swedish fish, so he got me not just a regular flavored pack, but he also bought me the assorted flavor, and then he also bought me this cute little ornament that has my name on it, a little snowman. How cute is that? That's so sweet. So I am so blessed to have such wonderful friends at work. And um, it's always nice to be remembered and thought of this time of year. And again, my love language is giving gifts and receiving them. And so it just warmed my heart just to the core. So, uh, yeah, just wanted to show that to you guys. And um, I know it's kind of funny. You know, you get people gifts according to their likes and stuff. And, of course, I'm always eating sugar at work. So my friends know I love chocolate and I love Swedish fish. So it's not like anything ill-meaned or ill-wished because I'm trying to lose weight so it's nothing like that but um I was just so thankful that the thought was there and that's all that counts and um and I'm blessed to have great friends so that's all I wanted to share with you today I hope that you guys all are having these wonderful days as they're leading down to Christmas um I'm sitting right next to my tv so you see all that flashing and bright lights but I hope that you guys have a good rest of your day and just hang in there. Tomorrow's Friday. And again, if some of you people have different shifts, just know that tomorrow might be your Monday, but that's okay. Your Friday's coming. And tomorrow is my last day on my unit with my people. I'm going to be starting a brand new job on Monday, so I'm really looking forward to it. I cannot wait. And I hope you guys just have a fabulous weekend coming up. All right. We'll see you guys on the flip side. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow.